the first part of this tutorial, we talked about bias, we've talked about truth, and a little bit about privilege. So let's start to look at how we use some of that information and tie it into other elements of creating an authoritative source and giving information authority. So the first thing we should think about is who's creating this information? Who is the author? What is their background that makes them an expert? And we can define expertise in various different ways. It could be the skills that they have or their life experience or work experience. They may have special training, a license, a degree, could be a professional position like a professor at a university. They could have awards that um, are either recognized by a large group of people or a specialized peer group. So there are just a lot of different ways to give someone that title of expertise. So Google them, see what information pops up about the author and who this person is and what makes them tick because you're likely to find bias and their privilege. That goes into play into who they are as well.